one good delivery. She's waiting again as Morgan plays it across. That's the one. That's the one that may win the World Cup. And it does come from the head of Wombank. USA lead again. Abby Wombank breaks the record. The 13th World Cup goal. Nobody's ever got that many before for the United States. Jill Ellis has been around the game her whole life. Um, her parents are from, from England and uh, she came over, her and her brother came over as young children and uh, they've been dedicated to the sport their entire lives. Jill has been in with the national team as an assistant for many years. She's been head coach of the youth national teams for many years and I think she knows football. She knows how to play the game. She knows how she wants this team to play the game. What I think is really important that especially our young players need to understand is that she has a plan. And her plan isn't to play 11 players for 90 minute games times seven games. Her plan is to develop some of these younger players so that they don't just come in, but they come in and make positive changes in a game and differences in a game. And I think that that's very different than maybe a lot of other coaches have, have had in the past. And I think that's what it's gonna have to take for us to get through seven games to get to the final. <music> 2014 physically was a tough year because I injured my knee a little bit. Um, and you know how that goes with your emotions and the mentality of am I ever gonna be back playing, playing as well as I normally played. Um, but right now I feel 100% fit, healthy, excited. Uh, and, and something to continually kind of keep growing off of because um, in order to win the World Cup, we all have to sacrifice everything, everything possible to, to one day be standing on that top podium. I think that we absolutely have what it takes to win the World Cup this year. It's going to be the hardest World Cup to ever have won. There's more teams, there's more games, there's longer travel, you know, Canada's a huge, huge country. It's going to be difficult um, no matter what team you are, whether you're ranked number one in the world or whether you're the 10th place team ranked in the world. And like I always say, in order to win a championship, you have to have a little bit of luck on your side. I know people say that you make your own luck, but when it comes to world championships and, and gold medals or silver medals, sometimes you got to have a little bit of luck on your side. We've got a lot of great up-and-coming players. Uh, I think that Alex Morgan, uh, Sydney LaRue, Kristen Press, and, and for me, I'm very focused on our forward line. It's, I'm the older player. I'm kind of, kind of the mother, so to speak, as it pertains to our forward line. I'm trying to get all of them as confident as possible because you know, there's gonna be games where maybe one or two of us are sitting on the bench in the World Cup. Uh, and tactically, it's going to be important for Jill and our coaching staff to do that so that we can save legs so that in the semis, hopefully we get there, the final, hopefully we get there, we have players who have fresh legs that can go on and not only win games by one or two goals, but we can win, win games decisively. And I think that's part of, uh, of our strength, a part of our depth and something that, that we really need to, to, and it's hard because as a female athlete, sometimes the confidence can waver. but. I'm excited for the opportunity because as a forward, I want to make sure all of our forwards are confident whether they're on the pitch to start the game or they come on in 20 minutes at the end. It's hard to say, you know, we, we just went down to Brazil and their team was very dynamic, dangerous. Um, obviously, I, I, I like the, the chances of Germany. I like the chances of Japan. I like the chances of even a Sweden. Uh, doing well and getting far into the tournament. Um, you know, it's going to be really hard. France as well. I mean, there's so many options. There's so many great teams that on any given day, anybody can win. And so it's going to be the details. It's going to be the set pieces. It's going to be uh, the, the, tactical, the tactical piece that coaches, you know, who, who are they playing? Are they saving legs in this game? Are they, are they pushing for goals in that game? Um, it's going to be so difficult to win this World Cup, but man, I'm up for the challenge.